<sighs> hey, golf. Molest, yo. Oh shit. Yeah, well, that's fine. That's right. I'm sparksless. It's fine. I think it's got to be like I guess I haven't checked all of Hum's PBs. I'm pretty sure everyone who has done a Sparksless run has died there. Because <laughs> it's so normal to splash in the water there when you're playing normally, and normally it doesn't matter. Those are... Those are, we need to figure out a time for, for hat in time. I also need to figure out what I'm doing for that. What? The heck. Bad. It's going all right. I'm really sleepy, but it's going all right. <laughs> Fuck. Thought I was gonna catch that, but I guess not. <clears throat> oh yeah, I pinged you in my Discord today. Uh, I I did. I finally caught up to your redemption. Yours is the next one. So at some point, at some point in the future. But yeah, I don't know if I want to just do any percent, or if I just want to play it, or... Or what? I don't really know anything about speedruns of that game, so... So at the, at the very worst, it'll just be an, like, an attempt at a, a somewhat speedy playthrough, but I'm probably not gonna learn any speed tech or anything. I have played it before, yeah. I wouldn't do just, like, a casual playthrough, because I have played it before. I also never did the DLC, for what it's worth. Seal the deal, or Yakuza Metro.
Yeah, that might be my plan, Muzz. Just figure out what they do and... Just, like, what, what levels to go to and just see what I can do. Nice. Solid. That's movement. That's gaming right there. Sheep. But yeah, we'll figure that out. That was all very bad. <laughs> okay, that's fine. We more or less recovered it. <sighs> Get out of here, you. One of the optimal routing. I don't know the glitch that got passed out. I see. Well, we'll figure it out. Oh yeah, I have a ton of time save here, don't I? I think I died like twice. Maybe more. <laughs> Maybe just twice. I died at least once. So yeah, that's a lot better. Also playing Skate 2, that's true. Hey Sarah, welcome back. Stone Hill didn't want to load there for a second. You still have 50,000 points? Oh god, you do, don't you? I remembered you had a ton and then only redeemed Amori. That's right, you were talking about potentially redeeming a Minesweeper game to, to satisfy that meme. That's fine, but we're okay. It's got me back into 120. Well, first of all, this is sparksless, and that's the only reason. <laughs> Nope. Ah. 
Hamilton was running Sparks List 120 for a bit, and he actually got a decent time in it. And, uh, it looked fun. I only had done a couple of runs before. So I wanted to, I wanted to try to get an actually good time in it. It's really not that bad. It sounds much, much worse than it is. That's yep. fine, I can get that on the way out. But yeah, I think... Honestly, I think after I get a time in this I'm happy with, I might just go back to reboot and keep doing that. See if I can't get a, a 42 time in that. Maybe even sub 42.30, I don't know. It would not save that much time, Buzz. Like, honestly, turning off the music might save... 10 seconds over the run. Turning off the voice effects would have a much bigger impact, but I also just don't want to do that. Because if I do that, I can't hear Bob say, Killer Calamari! every run. And that, if we're not getting Killer Calamari, then it, that's, that's a non-starter. Fuck. Fuck. Why am I not... <laughs> Jesus. I was talking to Pander about this a little bit in her chat last night. Um, I've been I've been thinking a lot lately about this weird thing with my speedrunning mentality. Hey Bagel, thank you. Where it's it's been kind of bothering me. Oh shit. Speaking of pander, um, pander, thank you for the raid, and I will say that again in a few seconds when I'm more certain you're not watching an ad. Anyway, it's it's been bothering me lately that I've never actually grinded any category, and it's. More than that, it's weird that it's been bothering me because it didn't used to bother me. It specifically did not used to bother me. Pander, thank you for the raid. Where, like, I... I used to not only be happy jumping between categories a lot, but, like, that was specifically what I enjoyed doing. I loved that I bounced between categories so much. But, like, I don't think I've ever stuck with one category for more than two or three weeks 
before going to something else for a bit. Even Vortex. When I was doing my last Vortex push, I think I was only playing it for like a month. I was not doing Vortex for very long uh, in any given stretch. And same for Cheat Percent. Cheat Percent I'm pretty sure I was only doing for a couple of weeks before I got my run. And even then, I was mostly just doing it during the 120 races. I don't, it wasn't like the only thing I was doing. So I, I think I'd really like to make Reboot what I try grinding. I'd like it to be my thing for a while. I'd like to actually get a really, really good time in it, instead of a decent time with all the routing. What's your suggestion, Muzz? Is it a solo 1545? Should I be grinding that? <laughs> Just get last place and settle? I guess I'm good then. I have last place and reboot. But yeah, I think... I don't know, I think there's been a bunch of things on my mind that have kind of led me to be thinking about this more. Crash 100%? God, no. That requires too much learning for me. I don't know. I guess the other thing... I'm gonna get that after the level. The other thing with Crash 1 is, uh... I like that game, but I think everything I've done with speedrunning it has just been playing it and trying not to make mistakes. I haven't really learned anything for that game yet, so I should... I should try that and see how I feel and work out more from there. Because, I mean, maybe, maybe I will really, really enjoy it. I don't know. But anyway, I... I think there are a few things that have had me thinking about this. Um, but one of the things that's just kind of been on my mind when playing Reboot again is I feel like when I tell people about Reboot, about that speed run, and I say I'm the only one who's speed run it, but no, I swear, it's not like... Like, I swear I have put effort into it. I, I don't feel like I can accurately say that my time in Reboot is really, really good. And that bothers me. I know I can do a lot better. I think I have gotten good at Reboot. Um because that is a naturally very, very difficult game, but that's different than saying my time is very good. Like, I... Oh, I did grab it. I only have barely over a hundred attempts in Reboot on my splits. Nice. Um... I don't know. I know I can do a lot more. I know I can be a lot better. And when I tell people about the game, I'd like to actually say with confidence, No, yeah, I've... I haven't just routed this, I've really gone at it. You know. three days, and then world record again a day later, you know. Ah. Heck. Heck. Heck! Spyro, what's this movement? I didn't even grab that.
Big heck. So yeah, I don't know. I I need to get that. <laughs> Told myself I'd get it after the level and just kind of forgot about it. I might try to see, like... I think I have 30 completed runs on my reboot splits. So maybe I'll see where my time is when I have, like, 100 completed runs. And then go from there. the extra world record back? No. I have fun doing co-op runs with Pepsi. I think that's all the N++ I need, I need in my life these days. I think I could get it back, but I just don't want to. It'd be hard, don't get me wrong. But Sims Run was very beatable. I mean, Muzz, you and I talked about that when it happened. I remember I mentioned that to you. I was surprised by how much obvious mistakes were in there. Damn it. Why can't I flame charge that bird? I'm not sure I've ever gotten a flame charge on that one, and I, I don't really know why. Slacking on his duty of telling me that I'm bad. Pretty sure that's his job here. Thank you, Bagel. Thank you. Seriously, dude. <sighs> I mean, I'll get it at the end. That's fine. It's the better route anyway. I just keep forgetting to do it. Rude. Also, I think I do... I kind of get what Bagel meant with uh, going to grind a category and then you just get a world record in it and then do it again. 
Because honestly, I felt that way a little bit with Reboot when I was playing it recently. And I guess, to an extent, this is the problem when you are the only person at the top of a game. Where you don't have, like, like in Spyro, I can say, when I go back to 120, I want a sub-130. I can say that, and that's great, and that could be my goal, and cool. And I, I won't stop till I get it. But when you're the only person at the top, you don't really have anything like that. Yeah, exactly. So you... You get a time that feels amazing for you, and then you just kind of stop. And that might happen really quickly. <laughs> Like, great, you improved the world record by another, you know, 30 seconds, minute, whatever. And yeah, if you keep running for five more months, then you might improve it by another 30 seconds or a minute. But the, the returns just feel so, so much smaller at that point. That when you don't have actual set goals, it, uh, it's hard to stay motivated for that. Which is why my current idea is go for a number of completed runs on my splits rather than a time I'm trying to hit. Yeah, I mean, I... That's kind of how I felt with Reboot when I, when I got my 43. That felt amazing, and I thought for, you know, a couple days, like, Oh god, I did it! That's great! That runs amazing! That's so good! Yeah. Fuck. And then I thought about it, and it's like... It can still be a chunk better. Not as much better as my last bunch of progress was, but it can still be better. But I already started moving on to other things. Right, I can't do magic stairs and sparks less. Should be doing it that way. Convenient flame charge. That's not right. This isn't the route. I think... Bagel, with what you just said, liking to compete with yourself, I think that's also a part of why I might be feeling this way suddenly, is with Reboot, I used to feel like, you know, yeah, it's a bit of a bummer that nobody else runs it, but I know that my time is really good, so it doesn't really matter that much. I can still be proud of my time even if there's no one else up there, and I'm starting to not feel that way as much. Um, oh, there it is. I don't know. I don't know. It could be any of a bunch of things that are getting me feeling this way. 
Oh, I didn't do stew step. What am I doing? My brain just shut off. What? That wasn't a flank charge? Come on, Spyro, get your head out of your butt. Spyro! <laughs> Stop. Stop. That was close. Oof. Yeah, yeah. Amy. Uh oh. you can charge jump that. I should be doing that. Oh my god. Yeah, golf with your friends seems like it's more fun of a game to just mess around in than actually try to be good at. Oh my god, get, get it!
shit. Seriously, dude. Back here. Yeah, okay, good. <laughs> what? Oh my god, there we go. Oh, right, I was supposed to do a different thing here. Whatever, it's fine. Might still be okay, maybe. Good enough. I'll take it. I should come up with a different route here, though, because that's going to be a problem. Maybe, maybe I can just get those before crossing the gap, the, the ones up top.
Faust. Um, red gem, thank you. Oh my god, <laughs> get around there. Okay, okay, we're good, we're good. How many lives do I have? I haven't been checking. Plenty, cool. Good. Got all the rest of those. Thank you, golf. Cool. Cool, cool, cool. Oh my god. I didn't think I got that red gem for a second. I'm actually playing this. Weirdly risky. Cool. Got everything. Shoutouts to Lucas. Sure that got it. Camera was not at a good angle when I went in. And drag? Yeah, thought so. Oh my god, no. Hit the wizards. Okay, <laughs> okay, we're good, we're good. those gems. It's a lot easier with sparks. Which I know probably sounds obvious because that's true of all of the gems in this game, but those especially. Nope. 
Not quite. There it is. Almost didn't jump there. We're fine. We're fine. We got all tire. I've wondered actually if it might be better to get that and then go back for these once those gems have spread out. Because you gotta wait a little bit when Blowhard dies to do that. I feel like that might just be a little bit faster, maybe. No, not in normal runs. Just in Sparksless. Fifteen to twenty degrees colder and rain. Oof. No, in normal runs when you have sparks, uh, if you charge into Blowhard as he disappears, the gems all home into you. So it's definitely better to do that then. But in Sparksless, when you don't have that, and it doesn't matter if you're near him or not when he dies, maybe it's better to run ahead and get that last gem. Okay, are you guys ready for my hot take of the evening? I think Terrace Village is a really fun level in 120, both sparksless and normal. That's my hot take. Reagan is a good M++ player. Wow, golf with the burns. How uh, how was the the whole community race thing? I didn't get to end up seeing a lot of it. Did you guys have fun? I'm glad. Sometime, I really need to set up a Parsec race to go through my cartridge race completion. <laughs> Maybe we can even get top N++ cartridge high score or MetaNet testing 5 on there. What a get that would be. Oh, that's too bad. Oh, that's cool. Neat little statistic. Fuck. Oh, that's too far. Oh, okay. Never mind. Shoot. Shoot. <laughs> Glad I had my eye out for it this time. 
Uh, yes. Yes, I do remember that. Oh, fuck. You can't charge jump backwards that way. Good to know. Good to know. Flame charge. I who did the interview with MetaNet while simultaneous with. I think I remember that, yeah. I think I do. I almost missed that boat. Amazing. That is impressive, but also mole. It's mole. Oh, that's cool. Oh my god. <laughs> Oh, if it was that first group, then yeah, it was Sim. Pretty sure Fnit started when you joined? I don't know, that was around when I tuned out. later. I, I think as long as I don't die, I should be good to get them later. <sighs> Almost. There's a cool new strat you can do with those spring chests where you can just kind of jump over them and get the gems. It's a neat one. I can start gliding there a lot earlier than I usually do. I think I was better about that glide when I was in practice in this game.
Seriously? <laughs> That, wow. Did you see Spyro claw himself up onto that ledge? Be everything. Nice. Very nice. Oh, you mean just start by going to the dragon? Focus on the frogs. What's going on on Monday? Shit. surprised I got both of those flame charges. Uh, starting a daily for two week audit, a particular store before you ship the trailer out, and you'll be the one in charge. Ooh. Mr. Responsibility Kid over here. fully completely done an audit from start to finish. Oh, fun. Ah. Interesting. Okay. So you get to just have good fun with that, then. Good fun pretending you know your way through it. Seriously, why am I having so much trouble with this? This is not hard. There it is. I'm sure you'll be fine. Crazy. I don't jump there. Fuck. Oh, heck. I had the supercharge. I could have gone for double stone now. Actually, is, don't, is double stone not even possible, Sparksless? Oh, shit. Fuck! I wasn't thinking about where I was. 
That's fine. It's not a big deal. I just feel dumb. <laughs> it's a time loss, but it's not the end of the world. It's mostly just that is a mistake I have made before, and, uh... And it's a dumb one. I should know better. Thank you, Pander. Can we get more white hunters in chat, actually? I think that is the appropriate response for what I just did. There we go. See, it was only a small time loss. Like I said, I just feel really dumb. Small loan of a million seconds. I mean, it would have been... It's more than it appears, because I think I was about to gold the level by a chunk, but even so, it, it still would have been, like, less than 20 seconds. Ah. Hello. Excuse me. Maybe around 20 seconds. I don't know. It's hard to say. It's hard to predict time save. Also have plenty of lives and don't need to be getting more. Lives. Lives never changes. Uh yeah. Nope. Less yeah. Much less yeah. Bug yeah. Also. More emphasis on bug yeah, actually. Because I know in a lot of ways that was pretty... Pretty oh no. But also in a lot of ways it's kind of bug yeah. In that everything is kind of bug yeah. got me. Do you guys see that metal head? That metal headed fellow right there? <laughs> Very good drop. Imagine being on cycle. What? Okay. Should have gone the other way. Oh well. Okay. Really surprised I got a jump there, but we're good. Okay. Could have been better, could have been worse. I'm good, I'm good, we're good, we're all good. Get out of my way, little chicken. Uh, do I want that now? I don't know. 
I don't know when it's best to get that. Wide Hunter. What? Okay. Okay, big level. Big time save level. A little bit same goal. I have a couple ideas of things I should probably do. charge seriously <laughs> that's a weird flame charge to get I'll take I'll take a second try there I guess the flame bonk might be the better term for it My dad's birthday is coming up. I should get him something. Got a couple of... Seriously? You know, while I'm down here. Got a couple of ideas. But, uh... Wait, what? Hey, you're supposed to reset. Knock it off. Apparently he got an Amazon Kindle recently, so my mom suggested an Amazon gift card might be a decent present for him right now. Also might, uh, might stop by a local bookstore and see if they have any, anything that catches my eye, really that he might like. Oh, I hope they're open on Sundays, actually. I didn't think to check. So I'm not positive they are. Okay, this guy... I'm getting this way now. Please. 
Okay, Golf, I'm getting these lives just for you. Just for you, and because they don't really lose time to get. charges there. Did not get that gem, though. Uh, those. And up here, and him, and these. Get those, please. Get up there, please. Would the task get those lives? No, definitely not. The task would do a game over uh, for credit skip, so it doesn't want lives. In time. And no, I'm not, because I'm not going for credit skip anyway. So, meh. Aha, got him. Actually, wait, do you mean a sparksless task or just any 120 tasks? Seriously? Dude. Let's go. Any 120 tasks? Then yeah, that's. Yeah, everything I said is true. If it was specifically sparksless, uh, the, you're not going for credit skip anyway in sparksless. There isn't one. Okay, we need to do something really special after leaving this level. And we've got to be careful while doing it. Keen-eyed observers may have noticed that I took damage when getting a dragon. That wasn't just for fun. I'm zombie now, which means I can't die, which is great. Um, but eventually we need to get out of zombie. Get. Um, and if you mess up doing that, you can soft lock the game. <laughs> Also, there's a lot I'm doing in this level that's maybe a bit riskier than I should be playing things. But we're good. The dog float is fun. Which part were you confused about, Bagel? Oh my god, I 
flung that dog away from me. Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> Oh, what was the way to do zombie you were familiar with? Because there are a few ways you can get it in this game. With zombie, you, uh... You can't pause the game. Forgot about that. Okay. We need to void out. That'll get rid of zombie. There we go. Um... I need to find a place to do that in the level. So... Yeah, so when you roll into the wild flight portal, uh, that kind of zombie we refer to as level disassociation, where the game thinks your level ID is in the wrong level, and so there are weird zombie-like effects. You can also get level disassociation talking to Tuco if he offers to take you into a level and you say no. That also gives you level disassociation, and you can run around Magicrafter's homeworld, invincible. Um, but you can also zombie by dying and rescuing a dragon. And it's not even a frame-perfect thing. If just something damages you and your body starts freeing a dragon, you'll get zombie. And that's what we would call, like, actual zombie instead of level disassociation. And it's also good just because, you know, you're invincible, but it has a bunch of downsides. Like, you can't enter portals when you're zombied, and you can't pause the game when you're zombied. Uh, and if you uh, go into water, the game won't change your state, which means you can't drown, you can't walk, you can't do anything, you just kind of get stuck. Uh, so proper zombie from damaging, from dying when you free a dragon is cool and useful in some ways, because again, you can't take damage, that's great. Obviously I'm, I'm big in favor of that, which is why I go for it in Dark Passage, but it's dangerous, you, you gotta be careful with it. But yeah, I really like going for it in Sparks Less and Dark Passage, just because that level... If you don't have to worry about damage, you can take that level so recklessly in a bunch of ways. Hey, yeah, Eyebolt. It has been a while. How have you been? I've been okay. Been running a bunch of non-Spyro things, but I'm... Happy to get back into Sparksless. Good charge. this stuff later. I don't know why I did completely the wrong rep last time. I haven't seen that, that emote. That's a good one.
Hello. Please, please. Please, please. Please, please, me, oh yeah. Okay, please, you. Ooh, jumps! Oh, god damn it. No, it's been demon toast the whole stream. Oh my god, what is wrong with me? <laughs> I've been messing up Lofty really bad. I say I've been as if I've been running this for a long time. Between this run and the last one, I have messed Lofty up both times. That sounds fun, Bolt. This is a really good song. This was my favorite song in the game for a while. It's still one of them. How are you, Pepsi? How was work? to extra lives. <laughs> It's Rossick. You seem so surprised to see someone that you just created. <laughs> How's it going, Rossick? How have the fan games been treating you? Okay, let's go. Let's go for a cool jump. Let's go. Let's go. Finish on the red spring chest. Oh, yeah. Oh my god. Even with those deaths, big time save. It's more game dev tonight. Nice, nice. I hope that's going well. So we're doing a big meme speed run. Um this is Sparksless 120%. If you'll remember from Spyro, you normally have a dragonfly that's with you, that picks up gems when you get near them. I'm using a... basically a game shark that's keeping that dragon flag on. So I'm at one health all the time. Am I missing a gem? Oh, no, I'm good. Okay. I'm at one health all the time, and I need to touch all of the gems to collect them. I, I don't have that dragonfly picking them up for me. 
World record is around an hour 40 minutes. It's like just over 140. How does it feel being a gamer? It's pretty game in TBH. Not gonna lie. Feels pretty pog, not gonna lie. Oh gosh. Oh gosh. No, we're good. Almost got those. Oh my god. I mean, it's kind of like a no-hit run, except it's... Like, this game is so easy, the fact you're on one health is the least stressful part of this. Needing to pick up all the gems on your own is just so counter to how you usually play this game. That's not, that's not one of these. Some guy is dissing your fly girl. I'm just gonna give him one of these. Ah, oh, god damn it. Why am I not getting the flop? What the hell? You just aim at the vertex. And you should flop. Like, every time. It's not hard. Why am I not getting it? I'm so confused and hurt. I feel so betrayed by the physics of this game. Have a good night, Rossick. If I don't see you say anything else, there you go. I also missed a ton of chat while I was trying to do that. I honestly cannot understate how kind of bothered I am that, uh, that I had so much trouble doing that. That's really not a hard jump to do. Also, two minutes in this level? What? Oh, no, I guess that is about right. Yeah, I, I did really bad. Change the physics to golf with your friends mode. Amazing. Every time I do anything or I'm gonna suck. Fair. Fair, fair.
I wonder if we can sub 150 with this one. Oh, well, that's not helpful. We'll see how we do. We're getting a little bit all over the place. Yeah, that's true, that's true. That didn't help. That didn't help anything. Fun fact, that didn't help. We have that sweet backup. Fucking why? Why did I get stuck there? How did I get stuck there? I'm honestly really confused about how I got stuck under that guy. guys, their bodies just, like, shove you out. So I'm not really sure what happened with that. Yes, Golify, I'm a little bit glad I picked up those lives now. It's okay. It's okay. We're still on a good run. It's not a big deal. Like, uh, didn't even want to hit that the other way. I should be aiming that first barrel towards those four guys. That's what I should be doing. Give it one of these. Seriously? Wait, what? How the hell do you do that then? Wait, did I actually get all of that? Oh, no, I missed that one. Dolphin. Be always golfing. Bag. I will take that. I should be losing time here soon. I've been doing this really poorly. I have all the gems at least. There's the time loss. You know, that was less time loss than I thought it would be. Always be bugging. Bug yeah. Well, now 
I am gonna grab that life. I think the weight of potentially getting sub-150 is sitting on me, and I'm just playing a bit worse because of it. I mean, you know, it's a big deal. I'm gonna be the second person to get sub-150 and Spyro 1 120% Sparksless. It's not something that happens to just anybody, you know. There is a board for this, yes. on the category extensions page. It's an interesting way to go through that room, but I'll take it. Oh, that was really bad, and I'm surprised I'm alive, but I'll take it. And there's the time loss. I knew that was coming. Why am I not getting doubles on those spring chests? Please. Thank you. Here comes the pizza, but here comes the time loss. The time loss is everywhere. Oh my god. No. <laughs> Forget, did I get the one cycle on my PB? I feel like I might have almost had it, but then I fucked it. But I, I might have also just gotten it, I, I don't remember. Really could have gone either way. I guess we'll find out in a minute here. If I save for like 20 seconds. Ah! I did not. <sighs> One 
more level. Yeah, the sum of best is flying down. I'm gonna assume was meant to say juicy sum of best. Also, I'm just just making that assumption. My goal in this is sub 140. Eventually. Hum's PB is just a little bit over 140. So it'd be cool if I could be the one to, to go past that barrier. <clears throat> I'm not gonna do credit skip for that, no. I'm also not turning off the music to reduce loads. This isn't run, yes. And like all meme runs, I take it very seriously. <sighs> you can do poverty credit skip. You can't do normal credit skip. Hello. There you go. Let's go, Pog Champers. I'm going for it. Yeah, I got the, the magic stairs there. Those magic stairs are not free. <laughs> I don't know how to do that. I need to learn the inputs for that to get the early rocket. I've never bother bothered learning early rocket and it's a nice little time save that I really should know at this point. <laughs> Spyro's learned to fly. I think this is just another flight level. It's the Juvie Strat. Shoot. This is gonna be weird. Oh, I got it anyway. Let's go.
please. <laughs> Pogger, one forty-eight, forty-eight. <laughs> Thank you, Pepsi. Pyro the dragon, you've defeated Ganassi Ganork, collected the dragon egg, saved all the dragons, and recovered every bit of treasure in the Dragon Kingdom. How do you feel? I feel fired up, Bob, and I'm happy for the Dragon World, of course. I certainly wouldn't want to spend the rest of my Dragon Day butting heads with Nancy Morgan. I'm happy I got another PB with. Dark Passage Zombie, because I'm not super good at doing that, and it's cool to have a run that does that. This is a very fun speed run. I enjoy this one. Yeah, I think sub 145 pretty soon. I'm not sure if I actually want to practice or anything, or if I'm just gonna be fine. Fine to just keep doing runs. Like, I'm not sure what specifically I would want to practice. I think, as usually happens with Spyro, most of my time save really just comes down to, uh, not having bad movement all over the place. Because <laughs> a lot of the sparkslessness of it is, uh, it's definitely noticeable in my movement. Strong, who is playing a game that I've seen a little bit of that looks pretty cute called Mail Mole. I don't know much about the game, I've just lurked in her stream a couple of times and it looks cute. Mole Trooper was playing it, awesome. Of course he was. I'm glad he was playing a mole game. <laughs> Thanks for hanging out.